Hello guys, welcome to today's lecture. My name is Hadi and today I'm going to talk about the uh, CW. I will just tell you and explain what the CW is. Uh, for in previous lecture we just made a program uh, to take the employee uh, data and uh, display them uh, as a table and uh, we had a problem for making the table a little bit look better because sometimes the name would take more um, length so we just need to uh, control the length of name or position position is at the end so that's that no matter that no matter so let's just uh, talk about set w set w or set width uh, is a function is uh, to set a width for a, a variable uh, and uh, its header file is io, manip IO manipulation I input output manipulation so it has also alignment control you can just change the alignment option so here uh, for name we have used backslash t two times but next this time we are not going to use backslash t we just need to set its weight into 16 means two backslash t so let's just check it and uh, let's just uh, change it to one uh, less than one less than one is zero so one one time it will run it will run one time and this one also will be one time so uh, let's just check it once uh, let's give the employee ID of first which is one it's age is 34 and uh, name is Ali uh, Ahmadi Ali Ahmadi which is more than eight then we are going to give the position ID manager for example so here let's see see Ali Ahmadi is actually this is it started it starts from right to left we have to change it from left to right by default set width is going to um, align it from right to left we can just add one thing else here right uh, left sorry left left now this is going to work this time if i give id1 page 34 ali ahmadi and this is IT manager this time yeah this one now it is working so let's just change it to 3 you can change it to 500 as much as you want I, I just want to take the value for 3 employees so so I'm just giving this 3 and trade employee I have so the first employee is 1 ID having ID 1 age 34 Ali Ahmadi and uh, he's the IT manager and the uh, next one is having ID 2 age 45 he is cleaning the room so I'm just going to write cleaner but uh, now his name is Ahmad cleans the room and the third one is 3 56 it's a boss Ali. Ali is the boss or the owner or the manager so see now it's working correctly uh, the same thing you can use for position uh, but now it doesn't matter because that is the last part so there would be no problem here so guys uh, let me just talk uh, about one thing else uh, in the next uh, file I'm just creating new file here hash include uh, still let me just write the syntax using namespace std integer main yeah here uh, I'm just talking about uh, a new data type I didn't mention a string data type string data type is actually used for a string for a text mm, you can say a sentence or a word but the problem is with cn here i have a, a string data type variable having name of name and uh, i'm just 
going to display a message for the user enter your name and backslash n then by cn i'm going to take the name of the user and again i will display that which is your name is just it. yeah let's see what happens string yes so here I'm just taking the user's name for example if I say Ali Ahmed do you think it works your name is Ali why it is saying Ali because after giving a space it will just remove other parts and does not take to does not take to so for that we just need to use the get line function instead of cn we just say get line this is a function and you give cn to cn we are going to take the name this time it will work enter your name ali ahmadi ahmad ali this time it will take all the sentence that you are going to write your name is Ali Ahmadi Ahmadi so guys this was today's lecture thanks for watching please like and share our videos to your friends and uh, subscribe thanks for watching